Welcome to Kelly's Home Experiments. I'm going to be showing you how to make some great home experiments with just some ordinary kitchen ingredients. Let's get started. First of all, we have a pepper parade here. I have this bowl of water and I'm just going to sprinkle some ordinary everyday pepper on it. Put some more in. A little more. And now I'm just gonna put a little dab of dish soap. Wow! Can you see that? All the pepper just blew away from it. What just happened is the soap broke the surf the surface of the water, and then the tension on the rest of the water it pulled the floating pepper away from the soap. Pretty neat, huh? experiment we use pepper. Now in this experiment we're going to be using salt to make a little volcano. So right here I have some water and I'm just going to use this canola oil and I'm going to dump it in. Do you see how the canola oil is staying on top of the water instead of mixing in? It's because the canola oil is actually lighter than the water so it doesn't sink. Now I'm going to add some blue food coloring. No, just one drop. It's not mixing in. It's just staying with the canola oil. It won't even go down into the water. So now I'm going to add some salt. Let's see what happens. What's happening is um, the salt, it carried some of the canola oil down with it. Now the canola oil is dyed blue. See that? That little bubble that just went up. Little blue bubble. It's acting sort of like a lava lamp. The salt, it carried the canola oil back down and then the salt dissolved so the canola oil came back up. For our next experiment, I'm just going to take this ordinary tin can, aluminum can, and I'm going to add two tablespoons of water to it. Now I'm going to come over here and heat it up on our stove. Once the can is boiling and steaming, I'm just going to turn the burner off. I'm going to very, very carefully Take this hot can and dump it upside down. Did you see that? <laughs> it, it popped and then it imploded. What just happened is the hot air and steam inside of the inside of the can just quickly turned into water once I put it in the colder water. So all that loss of steam and pressure made the can implode. Pick it up. That's amazing. Show it. See all that? Show the can. That's insane. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. For our next experiment, um, we have some whole milk right here and we set it out so that it got to room temperature and I'm going to add these food some drops of food coloring. Mm. Come on. Okay, we're not going to have any red in this one. Now I'm going to add a little bit of dish soap in it. Remember what happened to the pepper? Let's see what happens this time. What just happened is when I dumped the dish soap into the whole milk, it broke down the fat and that's what caused these 
the um, food coloring to swirl around like that. Ta-da! That has been Kelly's Home Experiments. See you next time. Woo!